Hey, thank you all for having us all here today. And thank you to Gina for allowing Jennifer and myself to come up and speak. Um, you guys may not know this, but Gina actually had 10 minutes to speak today and she could have used all that time up herself. Uh, but she saw fit to split the time between myself and Jennifer, two veterans that serve in her organization. And as a Marine, no such thing as a former Marine, uh, Pinups for Vets, <laughs> Pinups for Vets has really given me a wonderful opportunity to continue serving uh, once I left the military. And it's really an honor to be able to continue to, to encourage and inspire my brothers and sisters in arms. And it, I. It's really hard to put into words how great it feels to be able to serve with an organization and men and women who you know are 100% genuine, who you know are on your side, who you know really want to give back to the veteran community and are 100% committed to the cause. So I've never actually stood up and spoken with Gina. We've spoken at different events at different times, but this is the first opportunity I've had to just say, can we give a round of applause to Gina because she's such a genuine supporter in the fight for veterans. And she's a Congratulations to all of the awards recipients today. I, I found out from uh, some of the cadets over there that you guys don't know who's winning the awards yet, right? It's gonna be a surprise. Nice, so, okay, wonderful. So, <laughs> so this doesn't go for all of you, I guess, but it kind of does. So, um, I, I wanted to say that I may not know each of you personally, whoever wins an award today, I may not know you personally, but I've had the pleasure and the privilege of serving alongside who I believe are some really meritorious troops. And what I've recognized in them serving with them, I see it in all of you today. You guys excel, you lead, you sacrifice, and you'll continue to do so once you reach the fleet. And so what I want you to do is, is just realize that where you're sitting right now, it's not a coincidence. You're all here because you want to be here. You're here because you want to serve your country. And I salute all of you, whether you win an award or not, you're a winner today, and I salute you. So but whether I was or whether I wasn't, I knew I couldn't just walk into Army territory without challenging you a little bit. <laughs> so I would like to bring forth a challenge to you as well. Uh, in true Marine form, I challenge you to continue strong as you continue on this journey towards commissionhood. And I know that this is just one ceremony, this is one year, one ceremony, but this is just a chapter and the grand story that's gonna become your military career. And there are gonna be ups and downs, you're gonna to deploy to some of the most amazing locations in the world, and you're gonna have that one private who just cannot get it right and you don't know what to do with them. But throughout all of that, I encourage you to stay motivated, stay strong, stay meritorious, learn your troops' names, lead fairly, and stay Army strong. Thank you.